Okay, let's get back. Oh my god, why do I keep firing when I tap in? Anyway, X4. It's a game. It's a game I don't know much about, so I'm very much open to advice on it, but for now, uh, it seems like there's a bit of a war going on between the Paranid, Parasec, Parasomethings, and the religious nuts, the HOP. Probably not Holy Order of Pint. So I'm going to take advantage of that. I hope. Engage. And I want to go and suck up all the fat loot that Auto they're leaving pilot. behind. Disengage. Including space fly eggs. Okay, well I'm not sure I've got loads of time here. Let's grab what we can. Well, there's more space fly eggs, and I think it just said something about being valuable, so... Autopilot. Engage. I'd love to get myself another pilot so I don't need to rely on autopilot for this. Especially since, uh... It's come to my attention that... Incoming missile. Why am I being shot? Autopilot. Disengage. Uh, I'm sure I'm not really being shot. Anyway, I'm just here to, uh... Steal whatever they are. Whatever they're dropping in the area. I'm not being shot, am I? Yeah, my shields seem fine. Explosion imminent. Autopilot. Disengage. Autopilot. Engage. This is pretty much how I would play a Vorion back in the day. Disengage. Oh god, now I realize why I don't like the voices too high. Uh, okay, that stuff probably got uh, degraded away in time. Husks, microchips. I don't know if microchips are worth much, but hey, give it to me. Engaged. I am here to steal whatever I can. Hopefully it's not too illegal. Although illegality has not been a problem for some time. Am I actually getting that? Autopilot. Disengaged. You don't appear to be picking it up. Mmm, says I grabbed 20 something microchips. Yeah, I want to fly to the container. Oh, right, maybe we just can't seem to grab it. Maybe we are out of storage capacity. There is so much that I'm still learning about this game, so expect a whole lot more bumbling. Fastest way I can think to check my inventory is go to my ship, go to info. And the microchips are taking up all of this space. I do not know how much microchips are worth, but that seems like an encyclopedia job. Microchip. Where's, where's microchips? Uh, at an average price of not much, I don't think microchips are really worth my time. Installed any mods yet? Yeah, good point. So what I did was I asked for mods and someone said, hey, I've got a mod list. It was huge and I didn't understand what half of them did. And I generally prefer to grab quality of life mods as I run into things that bother me. So if I find something like, ugh, maybe there's an auto-targeting in this game and it really sucks to use because it's behind like four different key bindings, then I might look into quality of life mod for... Uh, auto guns. That's that's an example that I just pulled out of my butt because I do not know what auto targeting is like in this game. In any case, let me check what I subscribe to in this game. Huh. Jump and run, faster crew leveling, spacesuit Bluetooth, flyby looting, and sector explorer. The main one I was really interested in was that sector explorer one, and once I'm done looting this area, I'm going to see if I can put that to some immediate use. But looting, I shall. Is there an easy way to tell between goods that are um, storage goods for your ship and goods that are stuff that you hold on to personally? Because I find it difficult to know. Also, are medical supplies worth considerably more? Tell me more, game. Medical supplies. Oh, God, no. No, no one likes medical supplies. Get that away from me. All right, what can I have then? Hydrogen, oxide stuff, smart missiles. Now that sounds more like it. Autopilot, engage. Give me those smart missiles. Also a micro motor. I gotta say, war is pretty good for me. 
largely because I'm not involved in all of this, or so I assume. Disengaged. There we go. I, I got an achievement progress for it fell out of a ship, whatever that means. Probably what I'm getting for uh, stealing so much stuff here. At least I can quickly check what's new for me. I mean, some of this stuff looks like it's worth decent dosh, but I have no idea where I can sell. Look at all these programmable field arrays. Now those I need to grab more of. And these space fly eggs. We can turn them into jewelry. Or we can make them into caviar. But they are illegal, so hopefully that doesn't become a problem. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, casual 1.2 million in my pockets just from being a vulture. Hopefully my pockets are bottomless and I can have however many I want in here. Also, I'm sure none of these matter, so we'll just say goodbye to them. Well, if, if it's working, why stop? Let's continue to grab whatever's going here. Probably not hydrogen, that doesn't strike me as overly valuable. Invidium Oxide. Is that something I've been picking up for myself? Again, if... Now there's something I wouldn't mind a quality of life mod for. Show me if something is for my person or for my ship. It was something something Oxide. It's there. It doesn't seem to be worth anything. Unstable Mixture. Handled with care, surefire controlled way to produce extra energy. Racers across the jump gate like to refer to the chemical as Nox. I don't know, maybe it's a crafting ingredient. Which would make sense since it's under crafting wares. You know, every game needs a crafting system these days. Don't mean to sound too bitter about that, but I am a little. Anyway, this stuff seems fair enough, so get me over there. Engage. But I really need to find a way to liquidate these goods into money so that I can turn that money into, I don't know, some decent ships or something. Maybe some more guns. I don't mind fighting in this game, but uh, I do mind just dying due to lack of ability to fight back. I failed a mission earlier because I just could not keep up. Medical supplies, more of that oxide stuff. A basic weapon chamber. I like the sound of weapons there. Engage. So this is pretty cool. I just go around and take what I want. This is how war should be. I suppose one of the downsides is I'm not able to just enjoy the, uh, the fighting going on. I wouldn't mind just watching it. Autopilot. Disengage. Alright, you guys gonna keep killing each other, or should I start considering heading away and selling some of this stuff? And again, no idea where I'm meant to sell things. A defense platform, a microchip factory. I assume they make the microchips rather than wanting to buy them off of me. Looks like the, ho the HOP people are having a bad time, but they have what looks like a pretty beefy ship over there. A pair of them, even. I don't think this game shows the difference between inventory and cargo containers, and that's exactly... Am I moving here? Engage. Get moving. That's exactly the kind of thing I'd want a quality of life mod for. Yeah, my poor hull is dying here. I don't want to get out and fix it. I'd rather pay somebody for that. Autopilot. Disengage. Money is problem. Don't know what a mag lit is. Well, they still appear to be destroying each other. Good morning, Jake. I'm in fun figuring the. Holy crap, get me out of here. I guess I got injured by something that was next to me. Well, whatever it was, didn't seem to have dropped any fat loot for me. High energy catalyst sounds like a good thing. Get over there. Engage. Let's have those sh uh, shields regenerate and then get ourselves to relative safety, shall we? Autopilot disengaged. There we go. Now, what in the world is a high energy catalyst? Yes, so much stuff. Like this is the kind of game you want with a wiki spread across your thighs. Except the only wiki I could find was a fandom wiki, and those are god awful. Now, what in the world did I just pick up? Probably wouldn't go in my 
inventory here since that is full. So let's check ourselves. Oh god, so many, so many things here. Blah, blah. Oh right, it's another crafting ingredient. So yeah, if anybody knows where I can offload some of this stuff for some real money, I'd love to hear about it. But a lot of the stuff is red. A lot of the valuable stuff is red. Telling me that that is uh, illegal goods. No idea how that works, but probably pretty bad. Fandom is a curse. Yeah, it really is. And it's one of those clickbaity curse things as well. They keep popping up with like, hey, recommended page. You don't go to a wiki for recommended page. You go there for reference. All right, we're starting starting the next session here. So let's just actually we will use stream or two since it is the second stream. That makes more sense. Supposedly, there's a trader on every station where you can sell personal inventory goods, but you need to walk there on every station. Is that going to include, like, this microchip station or not? I better just go somewhere, somewhere considerably safer. Get myself patched up, if nothing else. I forget where that is done. I would assume a wharf of sorts. Yeah, yeah, why don't we go over to this Paranid Wharf. Set as target and... Autopilot. Get moving. Engaged. Hopefully there's no police that stop me and take all my goods. Again, I've no idea how that works. How do the police stop you and steal your goodies? I have no idea. But hey, maybe if I make some money while I'm on the wharf, I could ask the wharf to touch up my ship a bit. Don't know what could be improved or should be improved, but improving's probably a good idea. Let us take a look at your cargo. Okay, so that's probably one of those problems. Hey, I've heard that what you can do is... Disengage. I've heard that what you can do is, if you have personal uh, wares on you, you can, like, not be on the... Not be on the captain's seat and you'll be okay? I don't know, but I don't know what to do here. Because I don't remember how to stand up. This cargo will be profitable for me. Of your cargo right away. Wait, what the? Oh, Entering wow. System. That didn't Planet last long. Sanctum. Autopilot disengaged. Uh oh, disengaged. I want it engaged. Autopilot disengaged. Entering system. Right promise. Oh, God, I'm lost in what I'm doing here. Did I fly past the. Yeah, I want to go there. Right? Autopilot entering system. Profit there center we go. alpha. Well, I might as well go here now. Why am I still flying along here? Jane, get me off this crazy thing. Entering system. Silent witness. Autopilot disengaged. How do I how do I get off this? I'm, I'm trying to get off the um Ray the highway up. here. Oh right, I must have Entering stepped out system. of this somehow. I take fast choice. There we go. Right. Hold up there. I was trying to figure out what's going on. Argon Trading Station. Hey, that sounds like a good place to trade. Let's go there. Autopilot. Engaged. Jesus, I have no idea what was happening there. What did I hit to get myself out of my ship then? It must have been... I think it was D something. Shift D, perhaps? Control D? Autopilot. Disengaged. There we go, but for some reason... You lose autopilot when you are no longer in the ship there. Autopilot. Engaged. Now, curiously, what happened with the police there? I'm assuming that was the police that said, hey, hand over your illegal wares. Autopilot. Disengaged. There's a log, is there not? Ah, oh, jeez, I have no idea. This game is overwhelming. But, I don't want to be too overwhelmed. I do actually want to learn the game. Argon Trading Station. 
Docking granted. Uh, let's get in. Can't wait to get myself some docking software someday so I don't have to uh, manually do this. It's a bit of a chore and a bit of a bore. Oh, especially when I smash myself into the thing. Am I going the right way here? No, I don't, I don't think they want me in here. Funny, I thought that was where it was telling me to go for docking. Will Jake destroy X4? Will X4 destroy Jake? I'll bumble my way around it until I understand it. Then I'll be exacting upon it. But oh yeah, the, the day that I get docking software is going to be a good day. It's not a pleasant system. I guess it's there for immersion, but I, I think the I think the desire to go full immersion is a little ill conceived for a lot of games like this. But, you know, I'm probably not the target audience, I'm Successful not interested in space. Are. Right. Can I get rid of some of these goods that are weighing me down? Like all these medical supplies, are you gonna take these off of me? This is me selling them, I think. All oh, right, and I don't have them. What do I have? What a weirdly small interface for a scrollable list here. Hmm, pilots can dock for you, so docking software is just nice to have as soon as... Uh, as soon as you have your personal pilot. Well, I'm looking forward to getting my personal pilot. Maybe I'll wander around here and uh, find someone. Right, so as best I can understand, they don't want to buy anything I have. And the only thing I can buy of theirs is a little bit of uh, whatever they have here. So I guess I'm just going to get up and walk oh, yeah. around. Uh, this isn't how we get off. This is how we get off. I wonder if I could... No, I don't think I can repair my ship from here. So apparently... We've got a marine here who's pretty useless at everything. But he has a single star in piloting. Maybe you could be my pilot. Hello. I want you to be my pilot, because you're cheap. Good enough reason. Hello. I want you to take the Marea, which I'm currently using. Engaging. How do I... How do I say yes to this? Interact with the desired object. Assign a workplace. Right, work on my Marea. I want you to be the... Captain of it? I accept your offer of employment. Yeah, there we go. Look at that manly strut. So hopefully that means you can do all the uh, laborious flying for me. How about you, though? Hello. What's your story? I can't seem to see your stats right now. Also, what could I even hire you for? Hmm. I was hoping you'd long play one of these. A perfect blend of tycoon and roleplay, sure. But I'm... I'm not helping you. I'm working on how to even play this game. Whoa, slow down there, buddy. Oh, your stats are a bit blurred. Maybe you wanted a lot of money because you hate me. When did you start this game? How far do I have to go back to the vaults to... Oh, man. I might as well have started today. I did just, what, three or four hours of bumbling around last week in one session? That's the only other playing that I've done of this. Hello. Where's the trader? Sending you information now. There we go. I probably want to talk to someone here and offload some of my goods so I can have some bleeding money. Trader's Corner. Actually, yeah, this is one overwhelming game. And the fact that everything is happening all the time feels like you don't have a lot of time to just stop and think, but hey, I'll try. Oh, one thing worth considering is how's my friend doing with scanning the sector? He's doing pretty 
awful at it. But here we go, there's this quality of life mod I put in that actually makes them explore in a sensible way instead of just randomly bumbling around, so who knows, I might be able to scout out sectors yet. Can I help? Yeah, I need to here be doing go. some buying and selling, I think. So, I mean, you'll buy these interface units that I have for... I mean, I'm just offloading crap that I have been picking up. I have no idea if any of these are useful at all. And I'm not even sure if it matters. I'm glad he's actually paying me for this. So there's not a convenient sell all button, is there? That's probably a daft thing to use normally. I think if it's low value, maybe I should just hold on to it. I don't seem to have a capacity on... Uh, things that I can hold, and maybe some of these I'll actually care about down the line. You should craft most of the things you have, Jake. They get 20 times the value. I have no idea how crafting works, but maybe it's a good time to learn, isn't it? Let's come out of this and try Here you go. selling non-craftable stuff. <clears throat> Wait, these are spacesuit upgrades? Maybe I don't want to sell these? Seminars seem good for training up my crew. Alright, I should sell them the trade wares that I picked up. Hydraulic pump, mag lights. It automatically learns you recipes if you have components. Alright, but where and how do I craft? Huh, so ultimately I didn't have that much value of uh, trade goods to be selling here. Let's hold off on that just in case some of that Goodbye. stuff is needed for uh, for crafting. He said, look to the right. Hey! Nice of him to just let me use his crafting bench. It costs me money to make... Oh my god, right. Jesus. What am I even looking at here? They don't cost, that's their vendor value. I, I, I don't understand what I'm even looking at here. Well, let's try something, shall we? Let's say I wanted to make a needle. Oh, the top is what you make. <clears throat> ah, I see, I see. So we make delirium. It would use hallucinogenics and... Three hallucinogenics and a needle. Okay, so that pretty much elevates the price of whatever I have, but none of these I can make because I seem to be lacking some things. I think I get it. Hey, space caviar is worth umpteen millions, but I need a lot more eggs. I just found these eggs from trashed things. Okay, so question. Is it only crafting goods that are used here? If I go and sell all of my, say, trading wares, I'm not going to suddenly find that there are things I can't craft, right? Don't know. It's only crafting goods. Out of 60% of them you can buy from vendors, the rest are impossible to find unless lock boxes. Can I help? Here all you right. go. Alright, alright. Basically, bye bye all my trading wares. You're gone, you're gone, you're gone. Just because I want some cash to actually do stuff with. Here you go. Hey, maybe I can take some of his stuff to, to craft some things. That might not be the worst idea in the world. I probably shouldn't sell the space fly eggs then. They seem to be worth a whole lot if I just craft them into something. Mm hmm. What does he sell? He sells rare spices and bandages. For either of those necessary. Good luck out there. Yeah, if I get a bandage, I can make first aid kits. Heck, I can make up to three of them. So let's let's do some wheeling and dealing here. I say, can hey, I here you give go. me. Three bandages costs pretty much nothing, right? Good luck out there. And then... Dun dun dun! How do I actually make this? Ah, craft item. There's a hotkey for it as well, number four. A lot of fighting going on outside, what's up with that? Alright, so we're gonna craft three of these. I spent... I don't know, maybe like a few thousand worth of wares there. Can I help? 
And then I can Here you go. sell you my first aid kit for a markup. Perhaps a better question is though, should I? I mean, they're not that valuable. I don't know if I'm going to need one of these down the line. Oh, whatever, I'll sell a couple of them. Mm. You know, I'm going to keep my I'm going to keep my first aid kits. Sounds useful. Good luck out there. Otherwise, the only other thing he gave me were spices, and I'm not sure anything of this is going to be made out of spices. It seems like a weird thing. I suppose, on the other hand... Mm, on the other hand, we are able to make caviar, aren't we? Unstable crystal is here. Encryption module. Okay, I had I had it in my head that I'd picked up a lot more valuable goods than this. Felt like I poached a lot of good stuff. Hey, a lot of this stuff is not illegal in this system. That's rather nice. That's better than rather nice. But how can I sell some of these stuff? Highly illegal to carry one of these in your person, but not illegal here. Interesting. Programmable field arrays also seem worth some dosh, but I suppose finding a seller ain't so easy. Well, whatever. Let's get out of here. I I forget if I'm at a wharf or not. I'm not. I should go to a wharf and see if I can't outfit my ship with something nice. Those things cannot be sold. They're used in secret missions. You learn how to look for them when scanning buildings. So that's so. Uh... Is this my ship? Looks bigger than my ship. I guess it is. There's my pilot. Wow, I can jump. I can really jump. So I don't really want to take command of the ship. I just want to be in the ship and have you be my uh, my little pet. Can I help? I could give you a seminar, make you better at things like piloting, which is what I want you to be doing. I'd be getting. Oh, wait, what? Requires inventory where? Oh damn, I thought I had a piloting one, but I suppose not. Requesting permission to dock. Can you be Docking permission granted. Sure. Alright. Be my little slave and take me places. Where do I even want to go? I wouldn't mind going to a wharf and getting this hunk of junk fixed up. We'll try that out. If we have a wharf. Fun tip, your personal inventory, the things you see them as illegal. If you are not the one driving, they cannot scan you. That's what I was thinking. That's why, uh, that's why I wanted to get up as soon as I was being scanned, but I clearly didn't know the buttons for it. Right. There's an Argon Wharf. I want you to, uh, to dock and wait. Go there, dock and wait. Oh, he's doing it! I hope I didn't accidentally tell you to go there and dock and wait. But if I did, I'll just give you a different place to go and scan. Oh man, this could be better if I had a little sofa or something for myself. missions that I have, isn't it? Weird bounty and other weird bounty. Entering system. Are there are in items time? in your inventory that are illegal to the Argon Federation. Yeah, but not his inventory. Speaking of... What happens if he picks up some items? Why? I mean, let's say there were some more space fly egg things just hovering around there. And then we flew into it. Would he pick it up? How would I access his inventory? Maybe there's a way for that. He's my property, right? It just says ship's inventory. 
pretty sure there was a crew button. Yeah, here's crew. Can't rename people, which is incredibly sad, and God knows why that's a thing. Whatever he picks from lockboxes gets added to you. Are we actually going anywhere? I think we're very slowly heading towards this, uh, this place. Whatever he picks from locks boxes get added to you. Hmm. He'll become accustomed to police brutality unless you tell him to drop stuff. You don't need to rename them, Jake. Rename Yeah, but I want to rename him. I don't like seeing Captain Ulman Kuchtal. And it's hard to have many feelings for a ship. I mean, I suppose you do have terrible piloting skill, but come on, man. What the hell are you doing? Get us in that wharf. I mean, all the other AI ships aren't having too many issues. Flying around, killing each other, buying and selling. You can buy them seminars, Jake. All your pilots can be two stars plus for basically a thousand C. I haven't found any seminars to buy. I've picked up a few. Just from looting, though. Holy smokes, you are slow at this. trader have any? If he did, it went over my head. Oh, maybe I just assumed we were looking at the ones that I had, not him. Right, you sit there and think about what you've done or failed to do. Uh, actually, can I trade with this place without being in command of the ship? Maybe it's something that could be done from here. I assume lots of things can be done from the map. So let's say we're talking about our... Well, actually, what are you up to? Hey, you're still still scanning as you should. Excellent. We, on the other hand, hmm. upgrade and repair, trade with. Well, it's not like we have stuff to ditch here. the heck is the build storage? I don't know, but I want to find a trader here. And maybe a better pilot. Oh, Hello there. A human, sort of. Hello. And you are... Oh, well, you're too expensive for me. Sending you information now. The build storage is a silo. If you owned it, you have storage there, but since it's not your station, no. Okay. Can I help? Yeah. Here you go. What's up here? Now that he's crafting wares, of course. Don't know what's up with these spacesuit upgrades. Maybe I should look and see if I can upgrade my spacesuit. I don't know, with a second repair laser or my own scanner? God knows. Right, here we go. Apparently, I do have two seminars on piloting. But maybe I should steal a couple of yours. Yeah, they're very cheap. Why not just buy them? Otherwise, none of these wares seem worth our time. Here you go! Oh, right. So there's those programmable field arrays that I've been picking up. But I can finally sell them. I don't know if I want these. Were they any good for Good luck crafting? out there. I'll check that. If not, I'll just dump them for the dosh. Wow, lots of illegal goods here. I've already forgotten the name of the thing I was meant to be looking into, but... It's probably not here. I wonder if you sell the lodestone. Ah, here it is. Programmable field arrays. If I find flux capacitors and 
singularity engines, I can make something incredibly expensive. But I have no idea where I'm going to find these. I'd rather have the money now. Doesn't seem to be too hard to find these programmable can field arrays. Here you go. So, even if this is a terrible mistake, just just take them. Get them off my back. I need the dosh. Hey, you seem to buy the eggs. Okay. Seta is the most important upgrade. It's the time control button of the game. Speeds up time by 6x to... Well, that's cool and all, but I'm not sure that's relevant at this point in the game. I got no trade wares. I just want this, this dosh straight up. Look at all these interface units, though. Who needs this many interface units? Get these off my back. Good luck out there. Not relevant now, but you'll be playing Tycoon. Yeah, that's true, but at the moment the game is very uh, overwhelming. So I'm trying to do my best to just digest the information that's going to help me now, not the stuff that's going to help me 10, 15 hours down the line. Right. Well, I dumped some stuff. I have some dosh. Let's see if I can't do some upgrades for the ship here. Or maybe buy a ship. I swear there was another kind of trader that the, uh, the human was going to give me instructions about, but now I cannot see the human. This reminds me more of Star Citizen than I think some people would care to admit. Not me though. Hey! A better looking human. Hello! Uh, an even less affordable human. Yeah, I was interested in this ship trader. Sending you information now. I guess that's just another place that I take the magical elevator to. Whee. Hello. I could upgrade my ship. Hey, here's my Maria. Right. This looks really cool. Reminds me of upgrading my truck in Truck Simulator, but I have no idea which of these is going to be worth anything. What am I even looking at right now? Engines. Apparently I have a Combat Mark II PAR, which has a pitiful value, so it's probably not very good. Big numbers are better. Yeah, of course. I mean, but then again, if I look at this one, which is worth a lot more, it seems to be worse at everything. Oh, wait, that's a K. The one I have is worth 109,000 credits. Ah, okay, so it's not too shabby an engine then, is what I'm hearing. Gotta keep in mind, I only have 800,000 here. So, alright, let's assume that our Combat Mark II PAR is okay. We've got an all-rounder thruster. Why is my sustained weapon output in the red? I assume it means because I'm because using my weapons uses up more power than I can generate. It's my best guess. Mm, I'm not sure this is really worth the extra dosh. Shield generator, a Mark II. I think I already got this upgrade for the Mark II. Why, when I select my own... Ah, right, right, I was wondering why these were still in red. It's because I had still... You know, let's come out of this altogether. Hello. God knows what mistakes I've made. Right, so I have you... If I wanted to mark three, I would get a whole lot more shielding, but that's pretty expensive. I'm more interested in weapons. It means you can't sustain the DPS at 100% the whole time. Maybe I need a better generator for that then. Who knows? What's that dollar sign mean? Military equipment license needed. God, I hope I have a license for the guns that I do have. Software. If I get myself a docking computer Mark II, 
Hey, I'll finally be able to just dock easily, right? And how about a long range scanner mark two? What does that even do? I have no idea. There's no information on it, but what the hell, I'll get it. We'll kit out this nice ship. I don't know if it's nice at all or not, but I'm taking it. Hey! Got a bunch of missiles that I keep forgetting how to use. You can right-click them for encyclopedia. Is that so? Hey! This scanning software increases scan resolution, allowing more accurate identification of certain types of objects. Mark 1, Mark 2. It just says resolution 3 and no, not telling you what that means, but whatever, I'll do the upgrade. I have a police scanner. Inspect, ooh, wow, I haven't stolen a police ship, have I? I can buy myself crew? I don't know what that does. What's the point in crew? Mm. Now this is a yaki ship, Hello but they there. just call it police scanner. Okay. Uh, I do want my repairs done, so please do. Hey, it's at ninety. It's at seventy-nine percent hull. I'm pretty sure it was at much worse hull than that. Is it getting passively repaired by something? All right. Let's add all that to my shopping list. Confirm the order, and hooray. That didn't really buff up my ship very much. Your crew passively repair your ship. Hey, that's cool. Hello. I still would like something better on my ship. I don't see anything about the... Um, about the power generation. Is there anything that can actually do that? I mean, look at this. Sustained weapon output, bleh. I don't know what I meant to compare that to. But I do know that my sh uh, my guns dry up after a wee bit. Your ship has a built-in generator that cannot be upgraded. Well, that is sad. Okay, I'll be satisfied with what I have right now, I guess. At least my ship isn't uh, on its last legs. Yeah, I know I can freely repair my own ship, but it's slow. Too slow for my liking. Uh, where was the entry point to my ship? This is my ship, right? <laughs> ship, right. Whee! Right, honestly, I didn't learn much there, but the ship is hopefully in good hands. Hey, are you the one that's saying... Uh, Repairing it? Touching it up? What are you doing? Hello. Well, you're pretty cheap. But you're a god awful at piloting, so, uh. Goodbye. Goodbye, indeed. Press Ctrl D while at a station. You can teleport to your ship. Really? Let's put that to test. Are you sure that's not a mod thing? It sounds like a mod thing. Alright, Ctrl D. Whoa, what happened to this ship? Not good things. Anyway, that's not teleporting me. That sounds like a mod thing. Shift D? Ah, okay, there we go. Shift D. I'm impressed that the game would have that. Surely that takes you out of the simulation. Alright. What in the world do I do now? I could figure out what my elite vanguard is up to. He's still exploring. God, he is slow. He is so incredibly slow. Once he's done with this, how do I give him a new exploration order? As in, to do after that. Could I just say explore and then he'll do it after his current job? Cool, there's a collect drops thing. I don't know if this is going to take over his orders or add it to his orders. Oh, 
I suppose there's an easy way to find out. Well, it seems to be... seems to have not overwritten no. this, so... One order will never overwrite one, it always gets added. Oh, that's cool. Alright, well, just continue to explore for me. Even though you are incredibly slow at it. Like, holy moly, you are slow. You can see his queue. I can see his queue. It will be displayed. I'm looking and not seeing. I really want to see his cue of what he's doing. You select the ship, and then information. I'll get the information here. And then the top buttons. Uh -huh. Current order is fly and wait. Really? Okay. Then he's to fly to two grand and flying? Uh, if you say so. I'm sure you'll figure it out. But what do we do? Well, anything but the story missions. Insolent youth. Board a ship. Well, God knows how to board a ship. Get me out of that. Jeebus, these menu. Well, the game is just a menu game, as best I can understand. I wouldn't mind going and uh, brutalizing some people, though. Menus are way better than they are in X3. Yeah, so I was looking at uh, X3 when Alpha was playing it, and my god, it did not look... Holy smokes, look at all this unknown stuff. Let's see if I can't figure out what's going on here. But besides, I want to figure out how to give uh, decent orders here. So, uh, Morea, which is us, I want you to... Why don't you go and... Go and collect any crap that's, uh, that's appearing here. Stealing stuff that other people have worked for seems to work well for us. And hurry up with the undocking. I'm already on the ship. Or do we need to tell the guy that was hosing down the ship to move away? See, this is... I'd like to yell at this guy, but I'm not going to yell at Ulman Kutal. There's got to be a way to rename characters in this game, because it is... weird that you cannot... Oh yeah, was I not able to give you that seminar? Requires inventory where one star- I, I was quite certain sure. that I had bought. Can I help? Maybe I need to give him it. I don't get it. You need to get... well, that is weird, but how do I give it to him? I don't see an option to, uh... give him an item. Goodbye. He already has one star in piloting. Entering uh, system. Uh, Second contact. Well, there doesn't appear to be a whole lot of loot for you to go and grab. I guess you just go into the middle of it. What's all these things? Oh, it's asteroids, of course. Oh, I should have looked into buying a ship so that I could have it uh, go and do mining operations for me. Passive income sounds like the way to go. Data vault? Get over there.
That was probably not the right way to do it. Fly and wait there. Yeah, I want to buy myself a miner. I should have done that at the last place, but I did not. Can I help? I see, so I guess it goes basic, one star, two star, da 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 da. And the star is the requisites. Sir! Sure. I like that he calls me sir. It's the kind of respect I duly deserve. Waiting orders. Oh, hey, my other multi eyed freak. I guess that's just him saying that he's done with his job. Wait. No, that was you. You were right in front of me, but you still gave me one of those weird messages. Right, what's this data thing? Data vault. Well, wait out there, I'm gonna have a look at the data vault. Yes, the data vault. Oh, hmm. Data vault. What do I do with you? Well, head on over there I get well actually. Maybe I should get considerably closer with the ship. Moreya. Docking granted. Alright, step aside. This is my ship. Don't you forget that. Now where's that data vault? Right, what's your story? Data vault. Mm -hmm. Some red flashing lights there, as if to say do something to me. Mm. Where's my buddy? Oh, there he is. Does he automatically take control? He right, does! Yeah. Alright, just wait there. I'm gonna look at this thing. My repair laser, good to see it's working, but what would one even repair here? Perhaps these red looking things. Data vault. No, I can't seem to rename the Captain Franco. Which is making me very, very sad. I keep being told, oh, but you don't need to rename captains, it's the ships that are important. It's like I will decide what is important and what is not. Data Vault's gonna have in store for me. I guess I'll find out soon enough. Can you edit the name list? Uh, I haven't looked into that. I just looked to see if there were any mods, and there were not. You know, I just see some high voltage signs. Maybe I shouldn't fly so close into this thing. Keep up, yeah. Keep will keep up bringing freelancer up with regards to this game. What's freelancer's thing? Or rather, what's the deal with freelancer? What else? 
else is needing fixed here. Freelancer is easily the best space game I've ever played. Well, what makes it so good? Bear in mind, I don't care about space in general. What's bringing me towards it? What in the world was that noise? What's bringing me towards this game is the prospect of the big simulation and the economy. I really like being part of something bigger. There was something a little bothersome about that, what was it, Everspace 2 game? Really felt like it was uh, the show all about me. Too much focus on characters. Okay, what still needs to be fixed on this thing? I'm seeing a lot of green lights. Green is good, right? Just think of Mass Effect endings. I wonder if someday I can get a better ship. Oh, right, that I had um, spacesuit upgrade parts, didn't I? Spacesuit upgrades. Maybe these things are already in my spacesuit, though. Uh, that would make almost too much sense. So, what still needs to be done here? I'm not seeing any indicator of anything else that needs my magical laser blasted at it. So maybe I should... See if I can get up and inside you. Is that agreeable? Oh, hello, hello, hello. The hatches are open. I wonder if there are upgrades I can get to make my space suit considerably better to use. Oh, what's your name? Container. Come to me. Oh, my, my warm thing that brings things closer to me isn't uh, helping me. What about from here? This is nice and close, right? No, I gotta fly right into these. What in the world did I get? Was I paid for that? Now hold the phone, I want to read this log. Where the heck is the log? Options, research, player, ship, map, encyclopedia, tutorials, help. Legend, filter, info. Like, I want to read what I was just told there. Logbook, here we go, that sounds about right. Spacefly eggs... This isn't right at all. Why is this not showing everything when it's set to everything? I want, I want to read everything that just popped up in my bottom left log. But I'm not seeing it. Showed up in your transactions log. Ah, here we go. Was it just money I found in there? I mean, I don't want to poo poo finding money, but I was hoping for a bit more information. Why was that money there? And I'm, I swear it said more than just the money. See the inventory in the backpack. Nano weave is new. Pretty sure I picked up remote detonators. You could see there's value there. And another one of these. It was money and some components. You can see the components in your inventory with the exclamation. I see. Weird that it doesn't show the information here, but I guess it's wanting to 
have some brevity to it. Alright. Is it just one lockbox or are there others? I mean, it looks like there are other doors to open. Like, what is your story? Data vault. What even are you? Clunk. Doesn't appear to be something I can pick up. There was a way to scan, and I've forgotten the button for it. Completely forgotten the button. Shift 2. Okay, there we go. We decrypted some data and added it to the timeline. The timeline. Yes. The timeline. Mm-hmm, that timeline. Ah, here we go, timeline. The President End Massacre? Yeah, we're going to call me President End, military ships, blah, 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 blah. Thank you, Lore. I'm not going to skip skin for a Oh no, not you again. I am always in the search of knowledge. I have added a secondary task to your mission interface. I didn't want anything to do with the boron. And he wants me to unlock 29 of these. Holy, this guy's got demands. So it looks a bit like there are still some doors to open here. Does that mean there's things that I have yet to properly do here? It's a, it's a genuine question. I don't I don't do much in the way of rhetorical questions around here. There's a lot I don't know about this game and I want to get to know it so that I can efficiently squeeze all the joy out of it. All the joy that it has to offer. If your game hadn't been paused, it would have played a bit... Wait, it's not going to play the audio when it's... Oh, hang on, can I... Can I have it playing whilst we are... doing this? Oh, what? I need to be in the menu to hear it. Hell no. Why can't I have you tell me the story as I fly around desperate to try and see if there's anything else to repair in this place? You know what, I move too slow and too ungracefully. Where's my ship? Where did I leave my ship? There you are. Aurelia. Alright, step aside. Can I help, sir? You can watch me. I was checking with back on this game. I want all the advice you can hand me, but uh, preferably usable advice. Stuff that's going to help me 15 hours down the campaign is only going to clog up my brain at this point. Yeah, so we've got shift two for the scanning mode. Data vault. I want to know how to do things, not specifically what to do. I'll give you advice, the data vaults aren't worth it. Ah, I'm finding this quite worthwhile. Got some lore, got some dosh, got some items. And more than anything, it's just something sitting here that was somewhat enjoyable to just explore and find. What I want to know is, how do I know when I'm done with it? Do I have any way of knowing if there is a way to open up those other doors? 
because we still got some red flashy light things going on here. Mm. Yeah, like this thing. Got some doors here, still flashing, not opening. When the doors are all open, you're done with it, or when you get bored. So there's still some kind of bit to repair that I haven't found here. I can't see it if there is. Granted, seeing things is not my strong point. Now I can see why some people might map W and S to accelerate and decelerate. It's tricky to remember. Some of them don't open. This one, for example, is done. Thank you, that is what I wanted to know. Let's not waste our time with that further. Oh, bit of dosh there, not too bad. Can I get this mission off of my screen, please? I, d I do not care. Also, there is no reward for this, so that is very much an inactive mission. No mission offers around here. There's some supposedly important ones, but yeah, not sure we care about any of that. How is my friend doing? Did he finish up and move along? He did! Now I believe you're exploring here, right? Excellent! Oh, now that I can get behind. I can really get behind. Alright, splendid. Now, this is not my circus and not my monkeys, so you go and... Hello! Oh, I see, so he... I mean, this ship is like a TARDIS ship. Must be bigger on the inside than the outside. I guess he has something they could call his own... Um, his own crew chambers around here. Alright. My Maria, I want you to... Uh, well, I want you to go and do more around here, but... I can't seem to tell you to go to these unknown objects. What even are the unknown objects? I can tell you, go here. I think. I can just set guidance. I can't seem to tell you to just fly there. What's up with that? Can I help? Goodbye. Freya. Hmm. Why are you not going to this station? I can't even tell you to go to it. I can tell you to go here, but not there. Why oh, all these unknown objects? Maybe they're just asteroids, though. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Alright, tell you what, I'm a little curious what's in this uh, jump gate, so why don't you go and check it out. And I will not remember how to remove this as a waypoint. There we go. Alright, so we've almost got a million credits. The day that I have, like, one and a half million credits, I'll go over to a wharf and commission myself a mining fleet and figure out how that works. How are you so slow at this? Uh, buddy? Easy on the paintwork. Nah, I want a miner, Jay. I like the idea of processing whatever's in these asteroids. Hello? Something... Something hostile spotted over there, because one thing I do like to do is fight.
appears to be in an explorer sector. Just get over there. God, you guys suck at navigating through asteroids. I suppose it's not an easy thing to computate. Manual mining is somewhat fun. Really? I find that a little hard to believe. But you're right, I should give it a go myself before I have somebody else do it. But here's a question. What could I reasonably have this ship do? If I'm off in another ship mining, what could this ship be doing? It could be exploring, sure, but I feel like that puts all of its guns to waste. Is that one star cut him some slack? I don't think I will. What is that? I can't seem to select things from here, which is a little sad, but look at all these derelict ships. Oh, probably from all the fighting, right? I want some of that. Entering system. The void. Yeah, crap. I want some of that fighting. Step Hello, aside. Can I help? Goodbye. Uh, wait, where am I right now? In some weird voidy area. With a Xenon raiding party nearby. Alright, well. Oh, hang on, how do I... There we go. Come and have a go. M. Alright, come on. Oh, well, <laughs> I think that's going a little too fast. I overshoot you by 10 kilometers. How do I shoot again? Middle mouse button, I think. God, I am miserable at dogfighting, but... Get out of here. Will you stop firing? You, you dropping any fat loot? Actually, did I get anything out of that? Mm, no. But there is something potentially worth my time over there. Autopilot engaged. Put yourself in pilot shoes just now. You've been chucked out of the seat by the captain who charges into battle at warp speed, muttering, How do I shoot again? The poor guy needs a raise. I will be the one who decides that. Man, this tractor beam stuff is a heap of ass. Container. It's miles away as well. Come on. Eggs. Did I just grab some caviar, or did it tell me that I have more of the parts for caviar? So if I got caviar, that's pretty amazing. No, I think it told me I have 13 out of 25 things to make caviar. But I also got this extended fuel container. It's been a while since ship engines require liquid fuel. These fuel containers can still be found. Make something different. Sometimes modern engine, no. Okay. Hmm. Well, that was cool and all, but there was some actual fighting on the other side of the jump gate that uh, does interest me. But hey, could I talk to you? 
wouldn't mind asking some people where some things are around here. In Carcachua, Vanguard. Comms channel open. Where can I find... Hmm, you got a wharf or a shipyard around here? Sending you information now. Yeah, sure, let's Follow check it out. Engaged. Oh, wait, this is just taking me... No, I thought that was taking me back through the uh, through the jump gate, but it's not. Yeah, this is cool. Nice and easy way to find well things around here. Also, this place is ages away, and it is through. I think that is another jump gate, isn't it? Yeah. Been bamboozled. I wonder how big spaces. Entering system. Antigone Memorial. Hmm. You should always use Shift 3, long range scanners, to see the question mark in the stations. Does that take us out of uh, travel mode? Autopilot disengaged. Right, so now that I have my docking software, how close do I have to get before it's going to kick in and not make me have to do this manually? Now I know I could make my pilot do it, but uh, whoa, now sunshine. Short range transporter A. Get out of here. Did anyone like me for doing that? Also, what gave me the jurisdiction to just blow his brains out? Ah, oh, there we go. The ship takes over from this range. That's really not much of an improvement. Successfully docked. But it was much faster than using my... Uh, my pilot for it. Welcome. I'm having a very hard time finding a place to sell my microchips. Right, never mind, that's just how we wander around. Greetings, citizen. Hello. Goodness, you are expensive. Sending you information now. And you look like you want to die. Thanks for your help. Hi, wait, what? I destroyed an enemy of the Antigon Republic for the uh, intergalactic standard fare of 500 credits. Forgive me as I do not jump for joy. I wonder if you still if you sell any of these goods that I could put to use. Damn, that that's such an appealing amount of money, but. Space caviar seems to be illegal in a lot of places. Is there somewhere that it's not illegal and I could put to good use? Right, if you sell hallucinogenics or lodestones or unstable crystals, I'm all over that. Can I help? I'd say those out loud so hopefully there I can remember go. them. Suit? Hmm. Also, hey, you've got that thing for piloting. Give me that so I can teach my guy how to fly a bit better. There's a bunch of independent stations that buy and sell caviar. Yeah, I have not found any so far. Right, I don't own any of these trade wares, so I don't think I care that much about them. If you're trying to sell microchips, the ware, then you need to trade the sh them from the ship, not the trader who sells small goods. Yeah, I already checked from the ship and I couldn't see a way to sell it. But maybe microchips are used in certain stations more than others? I don't know. Is green good? Or rather, is that a good buying price or a good selling price? I don't know. Hand laser, repair laser, Mark II thrusters. That's kind of tempting, but I don't want to blow my money here over nothing. Good luck out there. 
Well, it's a shame you don't do the old lodestone thing. Maybe I can check out the ship trader. Whee! Hello. Let's say I wanted to buy myself a... Whoa, whoa, you only do large? I don't think I can afford any of these things. Oh, you only cost two million for a... Large... Mineral Sentinel? With a medium preset for mining? Oh, god, six mil. I'm assuming this is a mining vessel. It's a bit weirdly shaped. Well, I suppose it's not that far off something you would make in a Vorion. Spacesuit thruster is a must-have if you want to do these lower things. You need to go to a wharf for fighters and mediums. It looks like I'd be, I was thinking Doom as well. Here's the VFG. The Bioforce gun, as the movie would have us believe. Okay, is this actually a mining vessel? It's got a lot of crewmen. It's got mining drones and mining turrets, so I guess it is. But holy smokes, six million creds. Who has that kind of scratch? Wow, shift. Shift D just takes me here. That is pretty cool. Thanks for that hot tip. Uh, okay, right. What What in the world do I do? Seeking rare spices. Hey, there's a place right here that's selling rare spices. I could do that quite easily. Identify an economic boost. Build a fact. That sounds a bit much for me, but rare spices should be easy. I knew I could count on you. I just need to get myself back and buy them. I do really like how quick and seamless it is to move around in this game. No long loading Can times. That really tore you out of a Vorion. There you go. Alright, I'll take your 13 rare spices. Good luck out there. And now I will not remember where I meant to deliver these two. Actually, I didn't know to begin with. Oh, screw that. Just get me back in here. And now I can't move. There we go. Uh, so where are you? Where are you? Maybe you are here. If so, how do I find you? Are you that person? Hello. I don't want to. I want to spend loads of money on you. Goodbye. Oh well, no. Perhaps they're this way. And at the bar. Ah, I see. They were too drunk to make their way towards the trader. I mean, I'm essentially uh, Uber Eats here. Well, that was kind of simple. It reminded me a lot of the Bannerlord mission to get tools for someone. Say, so, hey, I need eight axes. Could you help me? You just go to the trader in the same town, buy eight hoes, and give it to them. And they pay you way too much money. All right, all right. Well, that was trivial. Not really what I was looking for, though. I want to kill people. Um, how about you just? Oh, right, right. We're gonna make we're gonna make something out of you yet. And again, why can't I rename you? I want to, you know, if, we, if we've got these characters that have progression in them. Can I help? I like the idea that I can have an attachment to them. Right, you are. God awful, but someday you'll be something. Uh, did that improve him at all? Goodbye. It feels like it did. Oh, there we go. There we go. You need to step away. Give him some personal breathing space to actually read the seminar. Mm hmm. 
Jake, you're likely to have a good enough ship yet if you have not upgraded your weapons and equipment. Oh, you're not likely. What do you mean, good enough ship? Good enough for what? I'll do what I want to do. Right. I want you to get me out of here. Just, like, just go fly here or whatever. This time he didn't wait to take off. I wonder if that's something that he learned in his seminar. Don't keep your boss waiting. Requesting permission to dock. Docking permission granted. You go, oh, cripes. Well, that was some quantum tunneling that you managed there. And he seems to be flying considerably faster than before, but maybe that's because we don't have all the asteroids in the way this time. Uh, wait, what, what, what just happened? Now that you have a few hours in X4, do you think you'd enjoy this or Everspace 2 as a long play? Well, I'm doing this as a long play, and I'm not doing Everspace as a long play. I gave Everspace a one-off shot because I wanted to see what it's all about. But I was not sold by it. And the last thing I want in a space game is to feel uh, strung up by the story. Why did you just take us through the Entering system. Why did you take Avoid. us through the gate? I don't recall telling you to do that. What the hell are you do? Oh, he still has this. Uh, he still has this thing I told him to do. That'll be what he's kind of up to. Right, I need to figure out how to clear out orders. Remove all orders. Although I suppose while we're here, why don't you just get the hell out of that seat? This is my ship. And how about I scan or something? Autopilot disengaged. What was the way to do this? There was a button to hold and release to figure out what's in an area. Was it three? No. Was it shift? something. Was it R? Yeah, that looks like it. And now you're going to tell me what's out there. Autopilot engaged. Huh, seems like a pretty easy way to just find what's around here. This station, I wonder if it's taking Z on damage. Alright, now let's say I was way too lazy to do this myself. That's when I get out of here. You take command, and then I tell you to... Hello. Yes, yes, hello yourself. Why can't I tell you to go here, though? I just want you to fly around and find these things. Morea. Fly... No? Okay. Well, fly over there. Scan is directional, it's not 360, it's more like a 180. Okay. I hope you're getting experience doing what you're doing. Where's your where's your specific pilot skill? It just shows combined skill of a star. Well, you're just there to figure out what areas are full of for me. Because you're on the ship, the controls are different. That seems weird. I just want to see what's in this area. Helium refinery. Oh yeah, I wanted to see who is even going to buy my microchips. Uh, I've got those clogging up my inventory right now. Used to manufacture electronics components. All right, so maybe I can offload it in one of those kinds of places, electronics or components place. <laughs> maybe the meat factory will buy it all up. Okay, that was a whole lot of not much out here. What's over here? 
Oh god, I told you to do that, didn't I? Right, I gave him an order accidentally. How do I remove that specific order? Mm, turn on data. Turn on data. Oh, trade data. Ah, there we oh god, no, this clogs up everything. But it does tell me where I can sell microchips. Thanks for that. Alright, how do I get rid of that order I gave you accidentally? You can change the orders in the information on the ship. Yes. Well, here's the Elite Vanguard's information thing. Waiting orders. Behavior. Ah, here's the flying weight that I gave him. I'm just going to remove it, and now he's just on it. Okay, well, that was nice and simple. God, a simple thing in this game. Never thought I'd see the day. It was you who I wanted to go and see what's going on in this unknown station. And I still want this removed from my... Requesting permission to dock. Docking permission granted. I don't know how to get rid of my guidance thing. There we go. I have to deselect everything. Alright, getting to grips with it. Boy, this is a game that... Uh, I feel like it was going to be a test at the end of the day of all of my knowledge of this game. But that's okay, I'm strapped in for the long haul. I, uh, I really rather like what I see in this game. And I think I like it because it, it could just as well not be set in space, and it would still mechanically be fine here. I think you could take away all the space stuff and just have this be the sea, and you know, I'm sailing from Hansa over to Hoyland to sell... Uh, not argon turret compounds, but maybe grain and fish and pick up some livestock and some cloth while I'm there. I like that. I suppose it helps that I uh, don't have my wacky quip-spitting companion telling me about how we need to remove our buddy from cryo freeze or whatever too much talking in video games these days <laughs> god no that sounds very old man problem doesn't it why have we come to a grinding halt here we have not we just moved very slow hello raiding party get out of my hello. ship uh, there's a button for nearest enemy what is it I'm sure it shifts something. Shift A? No, that's autopilot. Anyway. I'm having you. Autopilot. Engage M. Shift E, thank you. I can already see this going Pete Tong. I should save and save often. I'm not thrilled at the whole save scummy approach on this. But I don't really know the game well enough to approach it differently. Requesting immediate backup. I'm working at Whoa, Christ. P. M. Autopilot disengaged. Okay, yeah, but could we slow down a bit? I have got to get a lot better P. at intercepting. P. Fighting is not my forte. Uh, I appear to be getting shredded already. This might be uh, what one might call a very bad idea. No, oh, not autopilot. How the hell do I move away again? That was shift one for travel mode. Also, I'm pretty sure I have a f low fuel thing or fuel leak or something bad showing up there. Um. But the music's so cool. 
Oh yeah, okay, maybe I bit off a bit more than I can chew here. But the cool music! I'm not sure if he... Oh, I think he is following me. Right, well, all the more reason to... Maybe not go towards what looks like a capital-class ship. That might explain the crown that I see there. That's a proper battle, Jake. Those are big boy ships. I understand entirely. They are certainly, uh... Certainly going for me, though. Jeez. I don't think I'm long for this world. Oh well, might as well give him what's for. Ejecting. <laughs> Emergency eject successful. P. Alright, lesson learned there. I can't P. just go in gung ho and eradicate Xenon on my own yet. But I do want to. I wonder what kind of power it would take to run into this and actually start kicking ass. God, I'd probably need a fleet, wouldn't I? But that is good. I like... Oh, well, I certainly like the idea of there being loot just flying around there, but I'd probably get ravaged. Yeah, so this is the kind of thing that I do like. The game will just, will just come in swinging and say, here's a big problem, you cannot deal with it, but hey, maybe someday you can. And what it does is it motivates me to get good at the game so that I can be the one instilling this kind of fear in others. I like that, but I am pretty dead here, so unfortunately I have to sit through the agonizingly long load screen. A beefy Corvette might be enough for that. I suspect that's going to be more than I can afford. The cool part is these raiding parties can even destroy stations. Yeah, I like that organic nature to a game. Not the biggest fan of quotes in a game, though. Quotes feel like uh, a very lazy way to borrow some direction feeling. The game is a living universe. Everything is simulated. Nothing is faked. Is it really nothing faked? That sounds like a tall claim. I'd like to believe it, though, because that does sound very appealing. Okay, so let's not rush into fights where we are ridiculously outnumbered and outgunned then. The ships spawned by the enemy, they don't really build those. Eh? See, there we go. It's all falling apart now. It's just like in Bannerlord. Oh yeah, sure, there's, there's an economy, but it doesn't really work and the AI will just spawn units out of nowhere even if you take all of their fiefs and continue to raid you because we don't know how to make a mid or end game. Ah, Banner Lord. I shouldn't be too rough on the game. I had a fantastic time playing that game. The problem is, when I came back to it, <clears throat> after I was done with my stream of it, there was, there was really nothing to do. Once you figure that game out, the only fun that's to be had is in having the battles, which are great fun, but they're a little unrewarding when there's no greater game to work towards. I have a, a private game running where I just united Batania, declared war on everybody, and all I do is uh, defend Batania. And it's pretty fun, the battles are cool, but the AI is not that great at it. And winning the battles is meaningless because they will just free spawn more armies to attack you with. Yeah, Mountain Blade is just about smashing stacks of- oh god, I'm still here, aren't I? Autopilot. Get it's off of that! Actually, maybe we should just- continue to uh, run away very fast. What a time to be saving, huh? That explains why that station was taking damage. Hey, look at all those goods that I could have, though. Fuel containers, interface stuff, some more eggs. Autopilot engaged. Turn me towards that. We're gonna blast in that direction. Why are you turning around more than we need to? Autopilot disengage. Travel mode on, I think. No, there's travel mode. Oh, 
Oh no no, we we came across a big old battleship in the first game, and the, the cool music kicked in, and, and that's when I realized, yeah, I'm gonna like this game. All right, can I can I like grab this stuff as I cleave my way through it? No, okay. I had a, an idea in my head that I could just do a flyby loot, but I suppose not. Where even am I? Got Team Rocket blasting off here. Autopilot just get me over engaged. there. Just wait for the battle. Is that battle actually going to be over? Besides the. You know what, maybe I could maybe I could keep an eye on the battle. Ah, perhaps I could actually go to the station. Loot disappears too quickly, I think, to poach till the end of a battle, so it's better to go between two um, neutral parties. Oh, but look at all those goods. Go there, see if you can't just grab it without the Xenon. Whoa, I don't think without Xenon is uh, something we can do here. Ah! <laughs> Hello, friend. Well, that'll be what that noise is. No, no, no. Keep moving at rapid speeds, because these things are probably going to have their filthy way with me. Autopilot disengaged. Oh god. Hey, could I, uh, you know, Medical supply factory. get out of here? Thank you! Don't mind me! Ah. Uh, they wouldn't. They wouldn't destroy a uh, stationary non-combatant now, would they? Hey, uh, there we go. Defense drones, tear them apart for me. I should join in that fight. Maria. Get out of my ship. Why do I not have my shields back? Ah, there are my shields. What was it to, for nearest enemy? Shift E? Yeah, there we go. Come get some, you ugly bastards! M. Whoa, whoa, what's M. the hurry, buddy? Oh god, there's the hurry. Yeah, they rip me to shreds, don't they? Medical supply factory. Yeah, I need, I need back in, buddy. They, they are, they are dealing with me. Oh, critical. That's fine. Welcome. They wouldn't shoot a non-combatant, would they? Wow, these defense drones aren't so hot, are they? Are they, are they just waiting for me to come on out? I was hoping that they'd get shredded by the defense drones and then I could just steal their stuff. Argon. Come on, Argon. This is Argon, right? A-N-T? No, I think Argon is A-R-N, right? Antigon is a faction part of the Argon. Ah. Oh, while we're here, we might as well get a bit of trading going, right? This isn't State of Decay. You can't use allies to do all the killing for you. I beg to disagree. That seems like a perfectly viable way to play. 
Here you go. Ooh. Oh, that's not Angus steak. I'm a little interested in grabbing those thrusters, but they're considerably more expensive here now, aren't they? Hey, I can grab another one of these pilot things in case I grab someone else that uh, that I want to do that with. Good luck out there. Does he sell an AGI processor, hallucinogenics, or an unst Actually, I highly doubt he sells Nine illegal L. wares, if Here I had to go. guess. That doesn't really look like it. Good luck out. Well, I think the Xenon are getting Shreked, so that might be my cue to call. Hello. Alright, let's... Uh, oh, by the way, do you want my... No, not my medical supplies, my microchips. If not, I'm out of here. What's my hull at? It looks like not much. Alright, there we go, go. M. Short range transporter A. Short range transporter A. Wait, you're not Xenon, are you? Well, you're still going down. Short range transporter A. Stop your attack immediately. You will now suffer the consequences. Uh. This is sector security. Comms channel open. Reporting attack against the station. Affirmative. Criminal record has been updated. Excuse me. All I was doing was shooting your own, uh... Your own enemies. Argon Station security vessel. Okay, was that bad? That seemed pretty bad. You shot the station by mistake. Ah, okay. Ah, oh, damn. Well, hopefully not a... hopefully not a deal-breaker. You're going down. Actually, didn't it say <clears throat> that relations went down by like 20-something? Seems quite a lot. It's a temporary drop. Oh, that seems fine. Well, I hope it's Please fine. Halt. We will be scanning your inventory. Sounds like my cue to step away and have no illegal oh, goods. Yeah. How do I know once they're done scanning? You're going down. That was an attempt to threaten me. Can I help? Goodbye. Uh, I guess all those goods have gone. No, we still got some goods here. That's uh, probably not so hot. Oh, no, it's down here. God, I'm so lost every time. I was hoping to loot some good stuff there. Okay, so they didn't scan my stuff, they scanned his stuff. But you don't know when they're done with their scan. I'm curious if this processing panel unit becomes my processing panel unit. Get out of here. You cannot intimidate me so easily. I already have a 7A, and it's not worth the it's not worth much, sadly. But, okay, it looks like that was it, and it did go to me, if I had to guess. 
Greetings. Right. Argon Station security vessel. Wait, why is the security... St oh, right, right. They sent out a security vessel to deal with me. I assume destroying that's not good for relations. Probably very bad for relations. Perhaps I should uh, vamoose. Uh, don't mind me, bucko. Well, none of that went to plan. I made no meaningful difference in that fight, and all I did was... Wait, where am I going here? I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Entering system. Frontier edge. Where in the world is Frontier Edge? Well, whatever the case, we've got some stuff showing up here. Autopilot engaged. Don't worry, I'm getting that choppy FPS as well. I think it's that steamy, misty effect. Stop the ship. Switch to the spacesuit after telling the ship not to move and use the repair laser. No, that stuff takes forever. I did it before. You're out there just holding down the repair beam for far too long. Besides, if it's automatically getting fixed by my crew, then I don't see the need. The yellow pings are loot boxes. Huh, defense platform. And you don't want microchips, well that is a shame. I think that Newtonian physics button thing was explained in the um, the flight control tutorial, but that was a, a bit too advanced controlling for me. Oh dear lord! Uh, Autopilot disengage. P. Well, this, this could be bad. What have I just gotten into? Looks like Xenon Space. Looks like a bad place to be. Looks like a really bad place to be. But hey, looks like there's a way out of here, so... Uh, wait, which way is which? Yeah, I think I'm going the right way here. They drive on the right-hand side, which is irksome. Thoughts in the game? I really like it, but there's a load to digest and understand to play this game. It's such an information overload. It doesn't help that the game is menus upon menus upon menus. Oh, I don't think I'm autopilot, autopilot anymore. Wait, disengaged? Autopilot. Disengaged. I wanted to head up the highway. What are you, what are you doing? Autopilot disengaged. Wait, what? Autopilot disengaged. It has no interest in engaging in the autopilot for some reason. It's not a highway. Oh, well, whatever it is, can't we just go there? Looks like an autopilot, um, a highway. Super highway, unknown sector. Yeah, it is a highway. Unknown station. 
What's the unknown station? Oh, might not be a good station. Might be a uh, very, very bad station. Right. How about we play a game of I get out of here right now? Come on, super highway. Get me the heck out of here. Ooh. Huh. Entering Atya's misfortune. This doesn't Wait. seem much better. Still seems a little excessively deadly. And there's a defense platform right there. Okay, let's have another idea of just generally getting out of here. Where do I even want to be? I want to be away from here in a considerably safer area. How about somewhere they'll buy these, uh... Oh, crumbs. What are the things that I have that I want? I think it's microchips, right? You buy microchips. At the electronics factory. So let's go to the electronics factory. Go. Engaged. Get me out of here. Ooh. Okay, you can fire an autopilot. Cool. Entering Atya's misfortune. Do not One. mind me, friendly Zeno people. We have no beef. So where was it a wharf that I meant to go to to get a medium class ship? Because I do want to get myself a a mining vessel and give that a go. Cool to do all this exploring though. When we started off we just knew about this uh, this ring around the rosies here. We went off to two garden. What was what is that noise? What is that noise that keeps pinging up every now and then? I do not know. Well, this more misfortunate place doesn't seem too bad for getting a mining groove on. Look at all these asteroids. Every species have. Oh boy. That's never a good noise. I suppose sometimes it is if you're really looking for a fight. Autopilot, if, if you could not keep slowing down and speeding up at this vital juncture. It just means hostile within sec uh, sensor range. Alright, thank you. I'm pretty sure I'm being shot at, so uh, travel mode. on kicking in. Entering system. Frontier edge. Well, there we go. They're able to mount a defense now. But hey, the Xenon made a defense platform within Argon space. That can't be good for the Argon Federation. It's really, Argon really cool, platform. though. I need to get my head in the game so that I can actually mount some kind of assistance on these fights. I suppose the price that you pay for the very swift Entering loading... System. The void of areas in this game is that the saving and loading of the whole game is a little painful.
Let's see. I'm still hoping to fight another cack, and I cannot remember what or where those were. I think the cacks sort of branch off of the, the holy people down here. Those HOPs. Ah, so there's a Xenon mining ship. I can only assume... Entering system. ...that Second they would have had contact. some stuff to take. Oh, hello. Hello. It's just an S1. Surely I can blow that up. But I want to sell this crap first. Just in case the stuff that I pick up needs my inventory. And that's something I'd really like to have, just a ship with an actual inventory. This tiny, tiny inventory that I have currently is not cutting the mustard. Advanced Electronics Factory. Docking aborted. Docking granted. You know what, docking is beneath me. You take care of this. Looking forward to having right, a bigger yeah. ship so we don't feel so cramped together here. So I want you to dock there. Freighters can have 9k plus inventory, a medium minor 11k. Yeah, with my 500 inventory, I wouldn't be able to raid much of value out of that. What is taking so long, man? Look at that, you've got the two and a half stars in piloting. Get in there. That was a great mistake. Uh, you appear to not be moving, my friend. Get in there. Hey, is that a cack? It is K. Get out of here! You. Can I help? You appear to be doing absolutely nothing. I'll show you how this is done. Queen's guard. Autopilot disengaged. I got a job to destroy you, Khaki. There we go. Perhaps that 300,000 credits will be what I need to finish up my, uh, my ship. Right, now what in the world was the problem here? I want you to go and dock here. It's not difficult. Get you, go and dock and wait. Maria. He's doing it now. Don't know what his problem was before. Uh, Chief? Whew. He, I don't know if that's because of his pilot's pilot. Whoa, his piloting skill just went up a huge amount just from docking here. Kind of like a crazily high amount. Could I grind up someone just by having them dock and undock constantly? Or maybe something went weird with the, uh, with his not moving there. No idea. Hello. Greetings, citizen. Ask for a job offer. You'll need your wits about you for this. You just want me to scan something. Doesn't seem worth my time for 50 grand. What about you? Well, you're it would have been nice to find you earlier on for piloting. Goodbye. Get out of here. Thank you. Wait, what was I just thanked for? Oh, I was given an additional twenty thousand for taking care of the um Hello. Of the Queen's Guard thing. Oh my. Engineer, high morale. Goodbye. I don't Goodbye. know what engineers are used for or what morale is good for. I'm here to actually I don't know why I'm here. I'll check with the trader and then I'll offload those microchips of mine. Uh, here you are. Can I help? Here you go. Oh, with a voice like that, absolutely. And I'm almost there in my eggs. Hmm. Which are still illegal here, which is a shame. 
Well, I really don't have anything worth my time here. And they all seem to sell the same wares. Always bandages and needles and Goodbye. spices. Uh, there are a few quality of life mods. I don't even feel the effect of any of them, sadly. Yeah, see, I want that lodestone. But uh, I think what I really want are those space fly eggs. But yeah, where can I sell caviar? And for that matter, space lag. Someone said, ooh, you can find, like, priority stations. Great. Where are they? Oh, wait, I don't need to do this. I can hold Shift-D, and then... Surely I can do trading from here, rather than having to take direct command of the ship. Trade... God, I've only got 23 microchips. This was not worth the journey. Still, though, we get them traded. I got 22,000. It says due from trades. Okay, there we go. It takes a moment to go through. Right, well, I want a mining ship. So let's go somewhere that could maybe get us a mining ship. Which is probably a wharf. The Argon buys caviar, even though it's illegal. Traders will buy it on random stations. Ah. I'll just need to pick up a bit more caviar, it seems. Right, wharf, 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 wharf. It was a wharf, right? Yeah, probably. Anyway, let's have you go to the wharf to dock and wait. You know, look at that, the speed at which he takes off. I think keep an eye on that piloting. Maybe undocking is going to make a visible change in his piloting skills. Caviar is not illegal, it's the exit's mi- that really happen? I don't know what Ul Man Khutal is all about here. Also remember different species. I have no idea which are better or worse, Jay. Telling me that they're different gives me nothing to work with. It's like playing Bannerlord and saying, hey, uh, different... Um and different factions have uh, different units system. of varying qualities. Oh, okay. Bargain prime. But, uh, which are better, which are worse, which are good for what? I don't know. Need experience to figure that out. Yeah, but compared, I'm not sure at this early juncture is going to particularly matter. Dude, what are you, what are you waiting for? Go and dock. Are you even moving? He is trying to dock, but he's failing. Strange. Why does he occasionally just completely forget to dock when I tell him to? <laughs> the better ones are better and the worse ones are worse, says unhelpful user face. That can be difficult to give advice that's actually uh, actionable. And that's the term that I tend to use for it, actionable. Man, you are about as useful as a chocolate teapot sometimes. Yeah, I swear that piloting is going up a decent amount just from docking and undocking. And that's the real grind, although I have no idea what those stars actually mean. What's the difference between one star and five star in piloting? I just do not know. Also, why did I come here? Ooh. 
Rename, redesign, put into internal storage. You can store entire ships here. Doesn't make sense, it is a wharf. How does the passive repairing of the ship work? Now that I'm pretty interested in, not having to pay for repairs. Would I need to buy some crew? You need crew. Oh, I'm certain it was repairing itself a wee bit earlier. It doesn't on some... Really? I am certain that ship repaired Hello. itself a bit earlier. Right. You sell medium... I want a... a, a vanguard miner. Uh, yeah, sure. And I would like a, a medium preset for it. And look at that. I don't know if I could make any meaningful decisions to this. Two shield is probably good. Mining drill is probably good. Does it come with crew? It's got a very low amount of crew. Surely a more crew would be better crew? Newly built shields will be completed even the crew cannot be. Da -da 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 -da. Hmm. I don't trust that low number of crew. Let's bump it up to five service crew. Does that make a meaningful change? Oh, they're only oh, they're like 10,000 each. Who's got that kind of money? Alright, how bad could it be? Give me that Vanguard drill thing. Let's get it done. And now... Did it come with its own pilot? Oh, it's going to take a wee while to make. Only a minute, though. In that time, I could go and say hi to the trader. Xenon around here. Oh, we don't like that, do we? I, there's this like beeping noise. I'm wondering if it's coming from the game or coming from Can outside. Here you go. Yeah, still no lodestones available here. I'm unsure about the use of this. Oh yeah, sure enough, because they'll buy the space flags at a reasonable amount as well. Goodbye. But I want to make the caviar and get some fat dosh. And as for our ship here... Must be in-game. I tried to take my headphones off to see if it was uh, coming from the real world, but no. All right, a little unpleasantly expensive, but let's get this thing repaired. Attacks for my greed in trying to poach the um the Xenon. And actually, get an achievement. I have to start somewhere. What is this achievement? Tell me more, game. Build the first module of a station. I, I am quite certain I did not do that, but okay. You should probably move your three-star pilot onto your miner. It makes a huge difference. Yeah. Can I help? Does this already have a pilot or not? How do I even confirm this? I'm trying to tell him to go to the drill minor thing, but... Oh, I think I need to right-click. Right, right-click and make you the captain there. Affirmative. Are you just going to disappear through the back? No, you're actually going to get off, and I'm kind of impressed that there's an animation for him to turn around and climb down there. Really rather impressed. Mm, yes, you purchased a terrible one. A terrible pilot? How can I see the pilot there? I guess there's a crew thing.
Still a bit bummed about that accidental shooting of a station. Is there a way to avoid that? Or is it just do not shoot if you're near, uh, near a station? Better take command of my own ship here. It has a pilot, as you cannot buy ships without them. The pilot is not three-star pilot until they are. You cannot auto-mine in more than one sector. Alright, but I want to see my pilot. Where is he? Do I have, like, spare pilot here or something? I can't freaking wish I could rename these, uh, rename these guys. Alright, where is the pilot that came with the ship? I can't seem to find him. Oh! A friendly civilian ship. I thought for sure I was shooting some kind of criminal there. It's in personal info. Personal info. Probably not this, right? Personnel management? Who the heck are you? Oh, you're the guy they put in the elite uh, vanguard. You, I guess. No, you're a marine. Huh. Got three service crew and two marines. Maybe the pilot got uh, demoted to service crew. I, I, I do not know. The old captain just became crew. Ah, uh -huh, there we go. Okay, well, hopefully that miner can start doing some money. F uh, do yeah, yeah, do some money for me. That'd be nice. But, how do I even use the damn thing? That I do not know. I assume I just want to put it somewhere that it can mine out some glorious asteroids and such, but I, I don't even know what to look for or how to do any of that. Even though I played through the tutorial of it, none of it sank in. Alright, let's see what we have here. seem too helpful. We do have a mining filter, it's already on though. Also, let's get rid of that microchips. God, the, the noise inside here is, uh, well, annoying. Mm -hmm. Default behavior, hold position. Well, let's not have that. Let's have you go out and mine. <laughs> we could have you go and police. Um... Mining. Auto mine. Auto mine for. Oh, jeez, I have no idea. Me? Oh, God, no, not me. Someone else. Okay, he scared me there. Um. Local auto mine for, and I have no idea what to mine for. I don't know, ore? Where do we do that? I, I, uh, geez, I don't know. Requesting permission to dock. Docking uh, permission granted. I suppose somewhere near where you can sell them? But I don't know who's gonna want ore. Silicon beats ore. Invidium is best, but hard to set up without guides. Hmm. Well, if we do go for silicon, who even buys silicon? Can I search for people that buy silicon? Ah, here they go. There's someone here that buys silicon. And there's not someone there that buys silicon. Right, so you buy silicon here, apparently. Can silicon be mined here? How do you even find silicon? It's 
Sector information will tell you. Is a sector information? I, I, I do not know what sector information is. You click on the sector, yeah, if I do that, it's going to naff off with this stuff. Maybe I do need to naff off with this stuff. There is no... Oh, Jesus. There we go, perhaps. Okay, so apparently there's a bunch of silicon over in Hattie Quack's Choice. So maybe I can have you mine that stuff out. Local auto mine in Hat Hat Hatfire's Choice Three. All right, you gonna go and do that? Are you gonna be a snippety wee bugger on me? Well, they're undocking first, which is probably good. I wonder if he has the capacity to actually go and sell that in uh, in the right place. Problem with Two Star Pilot, he won't be able to sell in a different sector, only locally. Well, I hope someone there is going to buy his goodies. Feels a bit like Patrician. But then again, you're... Oh, right, way back in the old days in Patrician 4, before it was updated, you had to have a level something uh, captain in order to do auto trading and oh the grind to get to there I recall being a pain. But eventually they just allowed auto trading on everyone because playing patty without auto trading is just why. Why would you do that to yourself? Local auto mine is usually good enough. You'll need to map out sectors first to reveal the stations though. What, the miner won't be able to find it? Well, I do have my elite vanguard, who's still checking out Profit Center Alpha, and given that we're doing mining here, maybe it would be better to have him... In fact, you know what, we can do that, can't we? There's my elite vanguard, I'm going to tell you to stop exploring, and I'm going to tell you to explore this area instead. That way I'll surely find out what we need. Also, how are you doing as a pilot? Well, you're getting considerably better as a pilot. You were just a really crappy, useless guy when I picked you up. All right, there we go. So there's my, there's my miner. Going away to do mining things. I, I do not know how this is meant to play out, so I'm a little interested to see what he does. Well, he hasn't grabbed anything yet. I don't know what the color scheme here is. What is red? What is purple? What is this? Well, this is Fog of War, right? See how your marina has zero out of four crew? No chance it ever fixes itself. People were telling me that this ship doesn't fix itself at all, though, even though I was quite certain that it did. I'm sure I watched it repair itself a bit earlier. The color is ores and gases. Yeah, but I'm not seeing a legend anywhere. A legend feels like it. Oh, here's a legend. Hey! These are minerals. That's gas, and this is both mineral and gas. This is probably a good, safe ish mining area. There's a defense platform after all. Elite is on its way to hopefully not get shredded by all those xenon. And then go and map out the choice area. This drill is taking its fat time gathering anything, though. What's taking you so long? You're just kind of sitting there. Unless you place down resource satellites, the miner flies around blind looking for ore. 
Is that not something they can take care of themselves? I don't know anything about placing satellites. I'm guessing one needs some satellites. Right. As fun as that was not, let's make our way out for a bit. What I really would like to do is get stronger so I can take on Xenon in fights. That's... That's what I'd like to do. Of course, that's why my friend is out there making me auto money. Hopefully he can make me auto money. Your elite had 10 satellites in the start of the game. Oof. No missions going here. Still looking at my vanguardy thing though, aren't I? Needs a better name than that. Oh hey, there goes our there goes our scouty friend. And look at that, he's actually grabbing some crummy amounts of silicon. Good job. Right, so you're telling me that satellites are very useful for helping the mining stuff. Very helpful or downright vital? Where do I get satellites and how does any of that work? Actually, maybe I could tell you to drop a satellite if you have so many. Surely there's a way to do that. Should I do like a resource probe? Seems sensible, doesn't it? Alright, let's let's cane your exploration right now. And let's have you fly over here and drop a probe. Resource probes are what is required. They're obtained in a wharf. Well, looks like I want you to drop that resource probe right here. Actually, there's a load of resources here. Why don't you just drop it here? Yeah, just, just drop a resource probe. Deliver foodstuffs. good trading vessel here, clearly. The probes are optional. Yeah, but now I want to see how it works. Once you're done with that, go and explore the, uh, the region, please. So, here's our resource probe. It tells us that... Wait, what's the stars for? Are you telling me that this place is crap for... Minerals. Well, maybe. Probably. And this is the size of your resource probing. Interesting. Sounds like it's a good idea to explore, and then when you see these big clumps, drop down the resource probes to see what's there, and then get mining. Okay. I, I guess I can believe that. What are you doing now, though? Hopefully you're exploring. You certainly look like you're exploring, and I hope you explore in a sensible outward spiral pattern and not the weird random way. I don't really know where you're going right now. Or why this is still showing up. Wait, why does it say no commander? Is commander different from captain? Well, clearly. Default position, uh, default behavior rather, is to explore. Uh, you know what? I don't like the look of that. I'll just manually tell you to explore as and when needed. Right. Right, right, right. I think I, I think I've made some progress. Let's get some saving going. I always feel happier when I 
manually save games. Game looks fun, but all those menus feel very overwhelming. It absolutely is overwhelming. And imagine having that overwhelming feeling whilst you're on stream. It's kind of nail-biting. But it's also not very new, because I've played a lot of games that I know nothing about on stream before. You get used to it after a while. Right, that said, I don't really know what I'm doing at this point. I still want to get stronger and kill lots of people, but... Please hold. We'll be scanning your inventory. Not my inventory, I hope. I'm still worried about that. Them finding my uh, my illegal personal cargo. So it's rather bothersome. I mean, what, what am I meant to do about all this illegal stuff? I guess I could ditch the stuff, but I would like to sell them for the decent money that they're apparently worth. And I still don't know where I'm meant to find a place to sell these to. Nobody seems to want to buy my security stuff. Maybe I just want my pilot back. Alright, alright. We already took care of the cacks as well, didn't we? You can search for missions, the secret missions. I, I have no idea how to search for secret missions. Not a Scooby. Oops, I gave that to my wrong ship. I want to be myself. Autopilot engaged. Scan any station. Look for secret missions, and some will ask for those. Alright, so let's scan this shipyard and see if it does any of that. Look at the station building, looking for red beacons. Argon Shipyard. I mean, that thing there's kind of red. But I think that's like an advertising board. Way, way closer, like 10 meters away from... Holy crap, that's asking a lot. This is a red and blinking thing, but no, that's certainly not what we're looking for. You'll see red and sparks. I saw one of those. Doesn't seem particularly nice to find, though. Is there any indication of where to look? Secret missions. This feels like a con. We will be scanning your inventory. Yeah, I have a look. Man, this scanning stuff is getting to be a real pain in the bum. Maria. Why did you just say Maria? Argon Shipyard. Oh, hey, it's making noise. Hello. Is it you? I don't think it is you. I think it's something over here. Something's going all fizzly around here, though. You, perhaps. Taking a big risk by broadcasting. So you can do Are you interested in a job? I, I suppose so. 
We need a security description. Uh, think I'm a jigger. I want to get some wares seen as legal off the station. Security is swarming traffic. Scans don't. Da 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 da. Need a security decryption. So I have no idea if I can do that, but why not promise it? I knew I could count on you. Now I need to do what exactly? Hack the security control panel in second contact. Okay. Autopilot engaged. What the hell? Not sure I understand this mission at all. Let's reread it. Do I even have a security decryp uh, decryption system? I do! I have one! So I guess the implication is that he wants that off of me? Or do I need to use it? I guess I need to use it. Mm -hmm. I still don't really know where this is meant to be done. I have this auto... Well, it's telling me to come here, but it's just telling me to go straight to this jump gate. Autopilot entering system. Second contact. Uh, why, why are we now just going forward? The autopilot took me here, and then no further. What the hell do you want me to even do? There's no indication of where this is meant to be. Right, I need to get some wares off of this station. But station security's been swarming. The thing is, default scan, central... Da -da 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 -da. If you look, it says that you need to find the way to your designation. Find your way to second contact seven. Well, I'm in second contact two, so that's probably the thing, right? There's another sector that I need to go to that isn't here. Alright, maybe I'll talk to someone and see if they can help me out. You there, buddy. Follow mineral. Comms channel open. Where can I find second contact? Now. There we go. Autopilot engaged. Okay, that was massively unclear to me. It would have been a huge help if there had been something here that said this is done in the sector second contact seven. But hey. So is this going to work? I believe in you, autopilot. Autopilot. Entering second contact seven. Hey, there we go. Autopilot engaged. How are you finding the game? The game is overwhelming, but it's really good. I'm looking forward to the point where I understand enough of the game to just be able to play without feeling like I'm bumbling. Also, what the hell is that stupid monkey? I thought I had those things turned off. Oh, crap. 
I normally middle mouse click on a window to make sure that I am uh, active on the window because middle mouse button doesn't usually do anything but on this game it's shoot and frequently I easy now frequently I find myself just shooting out of nowhere you can do it autopilot you can be in bloody cue it I don't like this free look. Why is this free look not possible with mouse? Number pad just seems wrong. Requesting immediate backup. Well, I don't see anyone who needs backup, so you might be on your own. Oh? Xenon, eh? M. Autopilot, you you have just continued to let me disengage. Let me down here. Okay, well, perhaps not. Working on it. Cool your jets, lassie. Hey, save some of that thing for me. So I will believe so. Autopilot engaged. Also, did I pick some stuff up there? Hold that thought. Mm, can we even remember where the stuff was shown again? This decryptor module and fuel container and 27 maglets from that encounter. Again, I, I don't know why I can't just get the log that I see in the bottom left to read at my leisure here. It disappears way too fast. Autopilot disengaged. Refined goods complex. I just need to make my way in, land, and deal with whatever. Successfully docked. Huzzah. You got anything worth trading? Welcome. Probably not, because I certainly don't. Right, what was get up again? Control D. And now I need to get hacky hacky. Also, I wouldn't mind getting myself a new pilot. Hello. Well, it's good to see a human around here. I like having a little slave Goodbye. on my ship. You're tempting. Hello. Whoa. Goodbye. Crikey, you're, you're not worth that money. Hello. You look a lot like the other Hello. guy. And you're dirt Goodbye. cheap, but you're also dirt. All right, give me the other guy. Hello. You're hired. Now get on my ship, the Maria. I hope I live up to your expectations. Yeah, I too hope you live. Is this what I'm meant to be hacking? I guess. You're about to hack. Yeah, I don't see why not. Did I do it? 
did I hack? I'll wait for you to tell me to take off. I'm about to find that I hacked the wrong thing, right? Ah, oh, bollocks. Okay. Hmm. Can we pretend that never happened? No, I think my... Well, 15, 13, 52? I think my... Yeah, my last autosave was like 20 minutes ago. Ah. Uh, ah. Go find more hacking. Th I'm not sure I can just find those. I pillaged those from Big Fight earlier. Oh, that 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 is a bummer. <laughs> oh man. See, I saw the yellow thing leading over here, and I was like, "Oh, this is the hack thing, right?" But no, it was the very wrong hack thing. All right. Maria. Let's, uh, let's take it off here, shall we? You... Why is he going to here to go to here? Uh... The hell are you doing? Just go there. Still had prior standing order. Uh, I see, I see. It'd be nice if there was an option here that just removed all orders and made us do whatever. Oh, I'll be honest, I'm really bummed about that. <laughs> okay, right, well, I want that hacking thing back. Actually, I wonder if you could do the scanning. Well, I'm here now. What am I looking for? Some kind of pinging thing going on over there. What's your story? I think it's still wanting me to go back there, but where's the where's the weird yellow pinging thing? Perhaps I need to do that again. Pay attention to the radar, and it will show an object when you are actually near it. But Hmm. 
Okay, I'm pretty sure I was flying towards it when I came away from this, so I just need to look in the opposite direction again. You aren't close to it, Jake. Oh, uh, hello. What have we here? What's the blue ones then? Are the blue ones stations? Uh, maybe so they're ships or something. Lines it take. I thought I shot right through one of these earlier on. Blue are abandoned ships and crap loot. Purple is space anomalies and yellow is high value. How could an abandoned ship be crap? That sounds like free money. Pretty sure you can sell the ones that you find. Hang on, I think I see something now. I do. I absolutely do. What are you? Are you a mine? Lock box. No, you're just a lock box with ten locks. What does that even mean? Well, maybe it's better that I didn't crash into the damn thing. Jake, save the game. What was save again? Is it F5? Hey, he knows what he's doing. Alright. I am going to assume that what I need to do is Hello. very... Who the... Oh, right, you. Yeah, yeah. Aurea. Do your thing. I'm going to assume that I need to, like, space jam my way and very delicately hit the flashing red bits with my repair beam. Lockbox. See the orange blocks? You must shoot them to remove the locks. Best done by setting a single weapon to fire. Can I just like use my use my laser thing? Meow meow. Meow meow. Or does the repair thing not work for this? Meow. Hmm. Okay, I'm assuming that's not doing what I want it to do. Aurea. Docking granted. The repair laser A does not work on the lock and B, it's about 15 meters in range. I don't know how I'd figure out any of this without uh, people in chat telling me about it. Alright, let's do this a little differently, shall we? Perhaps I need to set myself to have just a single gun here. I don't know how to do that, but maybe I can figure it out by pausing and bringing up the ship screen, which I've forgotten how to do. Well, it's not that. Mm. Let's enter. Here we go. And let's just put on, I don't know, the pulse laser. Alright, 
You gonna work for me? Guess so. Pew. Oh, this isn't timed. It's slowing down, which is quite convenient. Uh-oh. Well, that was probably not what was intended. Yeah, blew it. Or did I? Wait, what did I just do? Oh, I figured F6 would load the game. It did not. It just gives you that kind of flyby, right? Can I load that back up and not screw that up? Oh, F9 is quick load. Okay. The funny thing is, literally any AI pilot can open them flawlessly. Really? Oh, I should try that out, see if my pilot can manage it. Yeah, I tried getting out, but apparently my repair laser isn't good enough, Theodore. I'm getting conflicting information here. We'll see if Damon works. Is pulling our leg or not. Oh, but if it fails and I load again, man, this is lengthy. Do you have a normal laser? One that does damage? One that works out of the ship? No, I don't have a laser for my... For my spacesuit. I saw it and I assumed that there would be no conceivable use for it. I had no idea there were these kind of boxes just sitting out there. Looked like a mine, though. When I first saw it, I assumed that it was just... Some kind of space mine that if you run into it, kaboom. We had that happen before. Autopilot is my way right into a mine. Or a collection of mines, and that was the end of me. Holy smokes, there's a lot of work to load this game. I wonder if the loading times are even longer the later you are into a game. All right, let's put this to the test then. Let's say I get out. Aurelia. You get to work, and then we say, "Hey, hello, buddy." Where'd the lockbox go? There we are. Collect the lockbox. found something out here. Uh, yes. Collect it, like I told you to. Oh god, he's got that other... He's got the other, um... Instructions, doesn't he? Christ. Or does he? Yeah, don't do any of that crap. Just open the damn lockbox. <laughs> oh, Can I help? You learn his pilot wings yet? Goodbye. Yeah, that that did not look like a successful opening, at all. Maybe he was too busy reading my seminar. Okay, so I want that loot. Demon Works says, So I've been fantastically lucky. No, it, yeah. Yeah, thanks for the advice. We'll all just sit through another loading screen, courtesy of it. <sighs> yeah, 
Yeah, it seems like the kind of thing that would um, be better simulated. But then how would you just find a lockbox that way? Maybe you can order your pilots to search for them. skills of being able to open this. It's hard to judge where your shot is going to land. They find them randomly sometimes, my miners keep finding them. And then how do you order the miners to open them? Do you have to manually tell them to do that, or can you set it as a behavior thing, like if you find loot box, open loot box? Further question is, where does that loot go? Let's say your miner found some space eggs. Does it just go to you? Do they hold on to it? How does that work? They send you a message. Ah, yeah. That makes sense, because my guy just sent me a message right now about it. In judge, there's a little white dot that shows exactly where the shot will land. Hmm. They hold on to it in their inventory. Ooh, doesn't that become a bit of a pain to manage their inventories? Maybe you don't have to fly directly to them, too. Hmm. Grab their stuff. All right, let's try this again. Maybe the bolt repeater is a better option for this. Let's see how you do. Oh heavens no. Okay, I think I should hold my ship steady and just aim with that dot. So, hold steady, and then I'll just go blip, 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 blip. Oh. Oh, man. I think we're going to be here for a wee while. Ships have inventories for large wares, like ore. I'm aware of that. Stuff like space eggs are auto-deployed to the player's inventory. Okay. Is that even if the AI pilots find them? Not a fan of these boxes. Oh, I'm not a fan of sitting through the reloading for it. I could just not be reloading it, but I'm really bummed after using the hack box in the wrong place. If I'd had a save before that, I would have loaded it, but it was like 20 minutes before. I'm not even sure I had the mission back then. I don't doubt it, Disarray J. It's alright though, if I can get into Open TTD, I can get into X4. I'm actually quite surprised I've bounced off the game, but I do find it very appealing. I think it's because of the simulation in it. The fact that it's all going on around us and we're just a small part of it does remind me a bit of Avorion, but better in that regard. On the bright side, X4 isn't X3. I was warned about X4 being two steps forward, two steps back. But it does look better than what I was seeing out of X3. X3 has insurmountable UI. It's really is UI the game. Alright. I find this difficult to judge distance, but that looks pretty close to me. Maybe even closer. Oh, oh, hold there, hold. Well, now we're really close. Well, the white dot is there. Dip, dip, dip. I hope that worked. Dip, dip, dip.
Whoa now, whoa ho ho now. That is a bad habit of mine with the middle mouse button. Like I say, I often just use the middle mouse button to affirm that I'm on the right window. Oh, I guess we get, got stuff. Security slicer, programmable field array, da 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 da, and it just stays here? I see. But I don't think I got what I need for the mission here. Press O to drag it. No, I think we just got it. We seem close enough. Did anything go into the ship, though? No, it was all goodies for me. And again, for the love of God, I wish that showed up in the logbook. Alright, I'm not sure I got anything of great value out of that. I already have these, crunch, uh, these crystals. Anyway, not what I needed, sadly. I need a control panel hack thing. I've forgotten the name of it. Security control panel, security decryption system, and that's not what I picked up. No, bypass system, something different altogether. Okay. Now, can I get any more of that stuff? Do away with you, by the way. Yeah, there we go. Get out of my face. What were the other things? We, we had... Um, we had some blue things pinging up before, and even though I'm being told they're relatively crap, I still want to... Hello! Something's over here. Right. I do want to check it out. I think I went past you. I certainly did. Let's go slap bang into the middle of you. Hmm. Is it not there? Did I manage to fly past it?
Well, Bolas laugh, at least there's the option in X4. State of Decay 2 just seems to hate mods, and Frostpunk even more so. Okay, apparently I'm pretty much right on it. But I see nothing. No, it's still a while away, apparently. Oh, there we go. <laughs> right, 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 right. Lockbox. What's your story, Lockbox? Are you a similar story where I need to carefully, carefully shoot you out? Because you look rigged with explosives. Security slicer, security bypass system. Was that the stuff that I needed? God, I hope so. I'm still waiting on that. No, no, it's very not. And it wasn't that I got three of them, it's just that it gave me another one. Decryption module, AGI. Uh. Is there another side to this lockbox, or was it just that one side? Just the one. Ejecting. Oh! Okay, Emergency right. Eject successful. Was not kidding around with the explosives there. I thought it would be like the uh, the little orange one, but it wasn't. Ah, oh, jeez. I don't remember if I saved after blowing up the uh, the other one. Well, lesson somewhat learned. Yeah, I know flack, and I'm not happy with it myself. But I think the alternative for learning this game is just going right back to square one with, uh, with mistakes like that, which does not seem that great. Be nice to be good enough to play this game, Iron Man. The years of EU4 have uh, taught me that Iron Man is the way to extract fun from a game. It's okay, in X3 you had to pay for saves with money. So I don't, I don't mind uh, saves that cost resources. My mind harkens back to ink ribbons in Resident Evil. I think the RE2 remake still used them, right? Iron Man removes all fun from a game. What? You th what? <laughs> Maybe in a game of X4, but I don't see that. I really like the ever possibility, or the ever present possibility of losses really truly hurting. State of Decay does that well. If you have a bad siege and you, you lose half your team, that's a hell of a setback. But it makes those sieges feel more rewarding to actually win because, hey, you know, you're not losing your entire team from it. Okay, perhaps this time. Get close, stop that, aim away in case I make a mistake here, set you on two. Uh, I don't know what I just did to cause that noise, but oh well. Now, let's have at with you. Pop, pop, oh, easy now, pop. This will be better if I'm considerably closer, I think. That's weird, why is the crappy lockbox so... Uh, so painful to lose on. And this really good lockbox, you can actually muck up a wee bit and still be okay. Is the only defining feature that this one is rare? 
Alright, give me the goods. I don't think it changed what was inside. I can check though, I guess. It'd be weird to save scum the different things inside the inventory, but no, it still had the security slicer, the maglets. I think this is all the same stuff? Because it's not a crap lockbox, it's stuffed with illegal wares. This lockbox is mostly legal goods. Is it now? Right. Uh, maybe this time we save the game after doing that. Some games are unplayable with Iron Man due to their buggy nature. Yeah, now that is true. I remember XCOM, can't remember if it was one or two, but the game just locked up halfway through a mission. Nothing could be done. Pretty hard to forgive. An experience like that, though, just stops you playing Iron Man in those kinds of games. That well, certainly stops me. Right. Still gonna open you up though. Err, uh, is that a problem? Hive guard. Those are cacks. I'm sure I can remove some cacks. Be doing the universe a favor. M. Um, hive guard. Didn't I deal with the Hive Guard before and it went particularly badly for me? It might, but hey, let's go anyway. Oh, there's a few of them. It's okay, I'm not alone. so bad in a dogfight. I wish I were better. Alright, but hey, last time we had some debris like this to pick up. Um. It actually meant some goodies for us. Yeah, there you go. Don't play chicken with a guy who only knows how to ram. I've played plenty of War Thunder. The only people who get mad at ramming are bad players. Exclusively. Now I'm taking actual hull damage here. Be gone. Hull damage. Yeah, I am taking some actual hull damage here. That M ship is probably a problem for me. And they are only shooting at me. Why is this guy not helping out? Sentinel. Not probably because he's bleeding miles away. M. Looks like I'm able to outrun them, which is rather nice. So we get back a bit. But then they also get their shields back now, don't they? Glad I invested in my shields, that's for sure.
think he's out maneuvering me. N. Give me the goods, give me the goods, give me the goods. Goods here. Hmm. Tuning software, field arrays. Certainly not the stuff that I need. Actually, it feels like nothing but junk that I got there. Also, I don't think I actually found the thing that I was looking for, did I? Too easily distracted, you see. Hmm. So this is the thing that I blew up, right? Ah, oh, but it's a complete wreck. I don't know how you know if you can, uh, if you can board a vessel. Vestrel, Sentinel. What do you want? Hey, you don't sound very happy. I'm not helping you. Right, where was that? Where was that thing that I was coming over here for in the first place? Yeah, I did board a ship before. That's how I got the ship that I'm piloting right now. This was just left behind by a cowardly pilot who refused to die. I happily took it, because it was a whole lot better armed than my elite that I started with. I wonder if that was some poke at the game elite that you get a pretty crummy starting vessel. I'm having a hard time here. Oh, and now I'm having a less hard time. Let's go. There must be a better way toward uh, to getting towards these things. Is it still even in this direction, or did I pass it by? No, it's still this way. The way that I was going through the blue made me think that uh, I'd actually bypassed it. Also, yeah, I see another one down to the bottom left. Antigon Republic mounting defense in second contact too. What do they mean by that? Probably not my problem. These guys are cool, even though they don't like me. Okay, it's still over there, and it's still probably miles away, given that it took a while for that thing to ping up. Thunder, gas, sentinel. Comms channel open. Sending you information now. Hokkaido, oh. gas. I'm not talking to you. Yeah, oh, man. Why you gotta be like this? Oh, okay. Let's not do that. Maybe I should set my guns off when I'm not actually in combat. That sounds like a reasonable idea. That took a few seconds. Though. I reckon I'm still a wee while away. M. An M Xenon. Could be something to poach. Uh, go on then. Holy cribbins, that thing is nippy. Get 
gimme. I, oh, I thought it said cooking mod, no, cooling mod. <laughs> well, this game does kind of have cooking. I'm planning on making some of that uh, sea sushi stuff. Space caviar, I think it is. Heading towards these loot boxes is certainly not the most exciting thing in the world. gone too far past. No, it's still over here. I'm not heading towards something different now, am I? Jeez. Um. Well, how can I not? Well, maybe by actually focusing on what I want to do here. I think it's close. That thing pinged up very quickly. And I'm sure that guy over there can, uh, can handle himself. Um. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. I'm not so sure he can now. Thunder, gas, sentinel. Hopefully a sentinel is good. So I'm busy getting shot here. And I've lost track of my uh, my booty. Yeah, they like me. They really like me. There we go. You you deal with this, not me. I'm not here to deal with this. M. Thunder. Gas. Sentinel. M. Well, I guess if I want to save myself, I should actually fight back a bit. Space bastard. And give me the goodies. Why is the why not coming towards me there? Um. Holy smokes, you are still nippet. I'm not so sure I'm getting anything out of this fight other than the paltry loot that they're dropping. I don't think there's anybody here saying, hey, thanks for destroying the Xenon, here's some dosh. Shielded up from evading me there. I guess I did as well, but the turning on this ain't so hot. Well, not compared to theirs, at least. Okay. 
I've seen Lenon, uh, Zenon can drop up to 180k credits apiece, specifically space eggs, which he sells caviar. I've been hunting that, but none of these guys seem to want to drop me some delicious space eggs. What did they even drop me? Processing panels, turn and uh, no, tuning software, crystal, catalyst. None of this looked like anything worth my time. Except maybe the maglets, but... Seta components. I think that was something that came up in my crafting earlier, wasn't it? Right. There's stuff that I'm actually heading here towards. And also, let's save. Yeah, I'm aware of the caviar thing. If I get my extra bit, I'll be doing that. I should probably check on my mining operation at some point as well, but where's the blue? Maybe I rode past the blue during all that dog fighting. Oh hey, I did get paid for that fight. A hundred grand, no less. Well, that's not terrible. Is there anything but terrible? Aha, there you are. Is that even the same one I've been after this whole time? Possibly. Okay, so it's like three... thirty kilometers away, maybe. That's probably not what I'm after, right? Is there a better way to find these things? Because I'm clearly not doing this particularly well. Oh, jeez. Maybe not getting distracted by these guys all the time is a good way forward. Tracking is over there, but destroying more cocks. Mm. Well, Jake, usually you just fly around in different sectors and you go for the yellows, travel speed towards it till it appears, and then mini map till you're there. It's usually fast. Let's see. Yeah, it stands to reason I wasn't doing things the optimal way here. But that's feeling out of game for you. Uh, okay, no, that wasn't. That was my rescue. Seems odd that they make you do that whole hold down for the right amount of time and release. Seems like needless scatter. If you map the universe, you find so many gold loot boxes. See that guy that I sent out in the exploration mission? Is he? Oh, whoa. Hold the phone there. That guy I sent out on the exploring, is he finding loot boxes and whatnot? Let's make a proper save. It's been a while. <sighs> All this because of this bleeding uh, hack that I messed up. Have a look and see what my buddy is doing. Oh, no, trade off, please. So the drill guy is... Uh... Hey, did he sell his stuff? Because he's empty now. Maybe I could check transaction on that. Oh, boy. What's happening? Hive guard. Eh, uh, not my problem. Maybe I can blow them up with this thing. Lockbox. Hive 
hive guard. Just couldn't let things be, could you? Okay, ramming is part of the strategy. Alright. Where's that lockbox at? Oh, well, I'm looking at the wrong person here for one. R for myself, please. Uh... Oh god, where did it go? This 3D space thing is hard to work out. It's on the mini-map. Really? I don't even know how to read this mini-map, but Lockbox. there we go. Let's try this again then, shall we? <laughs> Such a dangerous thing. You can click it on the radar to- ooh, now that's cool. I've got to remember to try that sometime. This would be a good one to have the AI show me just how good it is at. That's a one. This angle is terrible. There we go. That was almost a two. That was a two. That's a three. And done. Pump, targeting, fine meal. Hey, this one didn't look to have all the horrific explosives on it that the other one had. I, I certainly did not find the thing that I was after, though. I wonder if I'm just going to have to quit this hack thing. No, it doesn't have an expire time. I can do it whenever, can't I? Right, well then... How about we get out of this place? It seems like a silly place to be. Actually, unknown station. Autopilot. Let's go and see what there is around here for a change. I've clearly flown way off into the distance. And in fact, uh, I'm going to take a quick water break while we fly over to the station, hopefully uneventfully. Disengaged. Ejecting. Emergency eject successful.
So I was walking back to my PC and I was thinking it'd be funny if I got blown up when I was away. I'll be able to tell if I see the O2 meter. And I saw the O2 meter. What happened? Was it this one Xenon raiding party against the food ration factory? You got blown up immediately after you left. That is a shame. The biggest shame is just how long it takes to load the game. Oh wait, what if it just loads an autosave made after I got destroyed? I should have manually loaded. I hope you didn't disable save game compression. Uh, I have no idea. I saw it all, Jake. That idiot that the controls just sat there. Uh, I thought I'd be pretty safe, but I guess that's a poor thought to have. I'm really looking forward to the point where I can have a fleet. Looking forward to the idea of having fighters that move around with me. And then when we get into a fight where we're pretty much a walking army, or a flying army for it. Hopefully that's possible in the game, but I can't imagine why it wouldn't be. You could have fleets in Avorion, and the fleet management was a bit of a mess, but it was still pretty cool to have those big fights. Yes, it's very possible. Indeed, it's why everyone plays the x -Gar. That's the ambition that I have. Oh man, do we have to keep playing the oxygen noise while we load our enormous save? Right, where did I even save? I think it was at that lockbox. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay, let's stop doing that. A one, and a two, and a th three. And look at it go. Done. Dropped container included security bypass system three out of three. I don't really know how to... Can I pause and keep this thing up? Like, oh, for God's sake. I don't know how to read that sometimes. And I'd like to go back and read it, but it just continues to not be an option. Yeah. Right. Well, hang on, I thought it said it... What did it give me? Three out of three of? It still remains a little off to me what exactly I pick up from these things. Hmm. Not all that clue uh, not all that sure, but I've got a lot of trade value going here. Right, let's get out of here. This place has not been that great to us. Where am I even going? Still a lot to go and do that. I wonder where, where is it trying to take me actually? Seems to be trying to take me to the equipment dock for some reason. Remove all orders and all assignments. And it still wants to go there for some reason. Maybe the maybe the ship just really wants to get repaired. Like the ship itself is asking for this. Well, I don't see why not. Let's let's go there. Engaged. To give you an idea of x 4 scale, I've got to save with 30 stations, a shipyard, and a fleet of something around 400 ships, and I consider myself a cat. That doesn't sound very casual. I think you're uh, being unnecessarily modest about that. The messages like to show the required items to build something. So if it says 3 out of 3, then you have all the parts required to build something in the crafting menu. Hive guard. Is there a way to stop it from doing that? Because it's throwing me off of what I'm actually collecting. 
You'd asked for the directions to the equipment dock. Ah, yeah, that's exactly what I did. Right. I would like to know what kind of money I'm making off of my fleet. I'm guessing it's player information and transaction log. So our vanguard actually made a hundred thousand. Ah, sweet. Off of selling it, uh, I forget exactly what. He'll have himself paid off in no time. Is that all that he's done? Requesting immediate backup. Look, you're probably not offering me anything for that backup, so I don't know why I would or should. Entering second contact. Second contact. Two flashpoint. I didn't actually think, can I get repairs at an equipment dock? It seems like the kind of place that would have repairs. Get off my radar. I won't let you get away with that. Now how are you doing? You seem to be exploring alright-ish, but you're also not finding a whole lot of much. We found something out here. Entering system, Black Hole Sun. I still feel like so much is uncharted and it takes a very long time for one of my ships to chart even a small area. Like this is a small part of a sector and this guy's agonizingly slowly getting on it. Is it because his ship is terrible for it? The pilot's terrible for it? Or is it just that scouting in general is terrible? That's because you don't have scouts, right. Well, my question would be, where do I get a decent scout? Because I, I would love to have these sectors better explored than they are. Which is to say, not explored at all, really. It takes you five minutes to scout a sector by yourself. And it's like, I don't want to do it by myself. I want to have someone else do it for me. I have a mod that makes the scouting AI much better at it, at least. He, he goes in a... Uh, he goes in an expanding... Hexagon shape, although for some reason you're not doing a very good job of it, are you? I couldn't tell you why. Autopilot disengaged. Now why am I doing any of this? You there. Maria. My little rent boy. Hello there. You go and dock this ship. Am I about to find that he has another uh, order that's going to take him away from here? I hope not. That is... he's a docking. Don't right-click explore, it's super badly implemented, just manually do it, giving the move order. Again, I have a mod for that. And I hope the mod is working fine. What's the mod called, anyway? Uh... I was just looking at it at the start of the stream. It is called... Sector Explorer. And it is hopefully making it a whole lot better. Right, what are we even doing here again? It's good to see his piloting is actually going places. I could even give him the piloting seminar to get him to uh, weave it better. Sir. And it, it does. Oh, it gives him a full star. I thought it would only take him up to two, but no. Full one is quite nice. Do we even have anything on the ship to sell? We don't have a single thing, so I'm just going to get out and see what's what. Actually, how do I repair the ship again? Um, 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 you, here, upgrade, repair, not sure I clicked on the right thing there, upgrade, yeah, I think I almost clicked attack there, which would probably be a very bad idea. 
still don't understand what the service crew is for. 